Welcome back. Thanks so much for joining us here on Global News Morning. What happens when we die? It's a question that all of us have pondered at least once, and it's a question that one Canadian documentary takes a closer look at. So our next guests, Winnipeg filmmakers Stephen Gray and Chris Radke, join us this morning to tell us more about their documentary, Discovery Heaven. Thank you so much, guys, for coming in. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, thanks for having us. Yeah. So this is such an incredible film. You follow the story of a man who died, mm -hmm. who was pronounced dead, mm -hmm. and came back to life. Tell yeah. us more about this. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I mean, the whole thing kind of started as, uh, as a result of uh, some personal loss in my family. Um, I was really kind of seeking some answers, and I kind of wanted some, something concrete. And so we came across the story of a pilot who had apparently uh, died, July um, experienced life after death, and then came back. And, uh, and yeah, in and, and doing that, we, just, we, we were completely blown away by the story and thought, how come there's not a documentary made about this already? Oh, that's that's incredible. Now, yeah. this uh, pilot, the story of this pilot was widely reported in mm -hmm. the news in L.A. So how did you guys follow up with that and follow his story? Yeah, Captain Dale Black, I mean, just to backtrack on his story, yeah, he was in a plane. He was a pilot. Uh, you know, flew into a, uh, a large monument, dropped like 70 feet uh, to his, basically to his death at that point, two co-pilots, uh, you know, didn't, didn't survive. And uh, yeah, after reading that story and, and seeing the accounts and people's accounts, and uh, there was, this, what was it, LA Times was there. Yeah, the LA Times um, had a photographer on the scene. Uh, they captured moments after some yeah. photography. Um, there was an FAA report, the NTSB uh, had done an investigation on it, so it's well documented that he was deceased. Yeah, for so an we, hour. Yeah, yeah, so we came yeah. across that, so it was a, a point of verification for us to then say, hey, hold on, there's, there's something here, and this is really interesting. And then, I mean, after meeting him, Steve just basically cold called him, uh, said, hey, like, we are a production company, we'd love to tell your story, and we went down there, and Thanks. suddenly, I mean, long story short, very long story <laughs> short, uh, we went down there, and after meeting him and, and talking to him and, and doing the film and all that, I mean, it definitely changed how we per, our perspective on all of this. Oh, that's yeah. amazing. I'm sure you've had a lot of reaction so far because this yeah. film did uh, uh, debut last year in September. It's been in a number of film uh, festivals, yeah. and it yeah. has already won a number of awards. Yeah, so it won 14 different awards, uh, mostly in the U.S. right now. We're hoping to get into some, some Canadian festivals, but... Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're, we're really blown away by uh, uh, some of the response from the film so, film so far. That's amazing. Yeah. Now, uh, is there any way for people to view this film if they wanted to? Yeah, we released it online. So it's just on our website, discoveringheaven.com. And uh, we actually, so the, we're nominated for the Webby Awards, which is uh, kind of a big deal on the internet. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, um, so people can go online and, and vote for, for this yeah. as part of uh, the Webby's uh, People's Voice Awards as right. well. Right. That, that uh, voting does close on April 19th. That's correct. That's I correct. Understand. Yeah. So everybody go online, watch the film, Please. vote. <laughs> yeah. But also, you guys are trying to expand this. Now, this was a single documentary to mm -hmm. start off, but you're trying to expand it into a series. Yeah, we're trying to make it into, uh, well, I'm after talking to a couple of people they were kind of advising us that there was you know more stories to be told and then as we started into you know reading this and, and getting introduced to more people we were saying well this is maybe like a six seven part series that we can do we want to go all the way from telling the person's experience but also on the side of you know there's studies that have been done on this so we want to kind of round it all up but I mean the main the main thrust of this is to allow people to contemplate perhaps like you know where they're gonna go or what people are seeing and I mean, inevitably, we all have to come to that conclusion. Not to be morbid or anything, but it is a good thing to think of. And yeah. I mean, the response to us has been really good. I, we love the conversations we have with people. It's a, an ability to also, um, you know, share our faith and share what we believe, but also to hear what other people believe and to have that conversation. So yeah. I love talking to people. Love, like, you know, communicating with them about it. So that's actually really interesting. That's an yeah. interesting conversation starter. I'm sure not yeah, a lot of people want to talk about it, but it yeah. is, like you said, yeah. something that we do have to yeah. think about. Yeah. Now, you two are uh, part of a very small production mm -hmm. company and yeah. so growing this documentary effort is taking a lot of effort um, <laughs> yeah. what type of help do you guys need Steve I'll let you take that one <laughs> yeah. Now. You're probably... yeah so this project has been primarily self-funded so far and so uh, you know hoping to turn this into a, to a documentary series um, we're just hoping for some funding and uh, you know kind of response from the public so um, the, the Dale's film is 10 minutes uh, yeah. it's released online for free people can watch it online and kind of get a sense of what we're trying to do with this series. That's yeah. amazing, and they can visit your website to do so. Yeah. Discoveryheaven.com. Thank you so much, guys, for coming in to tell us about this yeah. documentary. Really interested. I would love to watch it, so I think everybody should, too.